Hey Grayson, I'm David Paulson. And I'm Allison Martinez. We here at Ram TV hope you're having a fantastic day so far. If not, I'm sure watching our show will help with that, right David? You know it, Allison. I heard that there's something that can help with those Monday blues too. That's right, Waffle House will be selling $1 waffles every Monday during lunch. So be sure to buy one and brighten up your day. I know I'll be doing that. In Grayson news, the Grayson Rams baseball program is going to a national high school invitational tournament in Cary, North Carolina. Support them by purchasing a Grayson Rams athletic cup for $5 or four cups for $15. Visit www.jhsbaseball.org for more information. I'll be sure to check that out. Also, seniors, if you want your senior ad in the yearbook, make sure you've turned it in by September 14th. Also, students, make sure you are on your best behavior this week because all teachers and faculty are giving out Ram bucks. Make sure you're responsible, respectful, on time, and ready to learn, and you could receive one of these. You may be wondering what these are used for. Well, if you get a Ram buck, you can turn them in to the box in the comments for a Bible key drawing or receive some really cool prizes like free coffee, hot chocolate, a Grayson Spirit t-shirt, and much more. I know I'll be on my best behavior. Now here's an interesting fact from Duke. Thanks for that, David. Hey Grayson, I'm Duke and I'm here to bring you the interesting fact of the day. So be prepared to be amazed. Did you know that sharks attack more men than women? No one knows why this is the case. For those of you who swim often, you guys have to be more careful. But don't worry too much because pigs kill more people every year than sharks do. And that's it for today. Thanks for that fact, Davey. Now here's China and Erica with Let's Talk Sports. Welcome back to Let's Talk Sports. I'm China and I'm Erica. Before we get into things, we have to congratulate Austin Meadows for playing in the Baseball Under Armour All-American Game in Chicago this weekend. He kept a diary of thoughts from the for the Daily Post from the time he arrived up all the way up until the flight back to Georgia. His team won the game 7-6. He's truly honored to be named a high school All-American. Good job, Austin. That's a really good title to have. Swim and Dive is in action now. Registration will be Thursday, September 6th at 7 p.m. in the theater. Any questions could be emailed to GraysonSwimAndDive at gmail.com. You know, I never really learned how to swim on top of the water. I just know how to swim under the water. Is that weird? Yes. China, I learned how to swim when I was six. Oh. You need to get on it. Mm. Grayson Varsity Volleyball recently played Shiloh on Tuesday. Let's take a look at some highlights from the game. Did you see how number seven hit that ball? Yeah, I'm glad I wasn't on the other side of that. But did you see Shiloh's number five? Wait, 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 hold up. That's your number, right? Yeah. Okay, I saw you out there. Yeah, I got game. Apparently, so does the ninth grade volleyball team. They won both games against Shiloh and Decula on Wednesday. Speaking of game, cross country has a meet this weekend at Athens Christian on Saturday. The football team has a game as well, Saturday at the Georgia Dome. By the way, did you see them Thursday morning on Good Day I Atlanta? did. I thought that was pretty cool. These Rams are going to be busy, busy, busy. Yeah, they will be. Girls, if you're interested in playing basketball this year, the time is now. There will be a meeting on Tuesday morning at 7 a.m. on the 28th in Coach Cooper's room. That's it for today. Now for Cheezle with the weather. Hey, little Bow Wow. You just don't know. Oh, what up, what up, Grayson? I'm Cheezle the Great. This weekend, we have some beautiful weather our way. The, the weather for today and tomorrow will be mostly sunny with both having the high of 86 degrees. The low for today is 65 degrees. Sunday, the high will increase by a little bit compared to the two previous days, with the high being 87 degrees. The low for Saturday and Sunday are both 63 degrees. The chance of rain this weekend will be really low with the today and tomorrow having a 10% chance and Sunday having no chance of rain. I highly encourage everybody to go outdoors and enjoy the beautiful weather for this weekend. Now, let's take a peek of my 30-second film called A True Love Story, which is about the obstacles Jonathan, played by me, is faced while trying to propose to his love, Allison, which is played by our beautiful anchor, also named Allison. Actor, director, writer, and even a dancer. 
All right, now back to Allison David with the closing announcement. So that weather report, Jesu. Now moving on to celebrity news. I'm sure most of you are aware of the relationship between Rihanna and Chris Brown a while back, and that Chris physically abused her. Well, this week, Rihanna opened up about her feelings on the situation to Oprah. But her thoughts on what happened and her feelings about Chris may not be what you were expecting. Rihanna told Oprah, we love each other and we probably always will. And that's not anything that we're going to try to change. And explain that whenever she sees Chris, it's awkward because I still love him. Hmm. Well, in other news, kids, make sure you don't microwave your socks and undies and accidentally set your house on fire. What? No way. That didn't happen. Yeah, it so did. British firefighters showed up to a man's house last week to save an apartment from burning down. When they got there, they realized that the source of the fire was a microwave oven. Oh yeah, I remember hearing about that. So kids, never put any kind of clothing in the microwave or oven. It could lead to dangerous things. It sure could. And that's all we have for you today. We hope you enjoyed this edition of Ram TV and that you'll tune in next Friday during your advisement. I'm David Paulson. And I'm Allison Martinez. Have a great rest of your day and an even better weekend. And remember ladies, stay Gucci.